Oh, friends. So, before we made the big poll yesterday, welcome back. Hey, a couple things I got to address right away. Um, the, the music at the beginning of the videos, there's so many people over the past couple of years since we've had that for intro music. Friends, that's, that's Hogan's buddy from uh, the odd neighborhood. That's my, he used to come in my house at five years old and six years old and pick up the, we always had instruments around the house. And he would, he would just, he was a talent. He was a virtuoso. You could tell from, from a very young age, Hogan, the same with the music and, and, and my mom. And I mean, myself, I'm a bit of a hack, but, uh, that's, that's, I came home one day from cotton and I pulled in the driveway and this is no joke. It's not a word of lie or embellishment. I pulled in the driveway, Hogan's, Hey boy, how you doing? And I hear this, and it was Travis upstairs on the organ. I literally, you know, something that just hits you. It's like, you just go to it. So I, I ran up the stairs and that was us. Just, just, we, that was it. It was about a minute and a half. And I happened to turn it on, to turn the camera on. And that is our, that is our intro music. Friends, it's, it's me on the kit. And, and uh, I just kind of jumped in to already what was happening and gave what I felt was needed at that time. So that, that's, that's that little intro music. Um, some people want more of it, they ask, and this and that. And well, you just never know what life is, is going to bring, friends. I could be on stage again with my buddy Clay Walker blowing a, blowing a tune. or, or I, Music is part of my life. I don't know when it will reappear in, in any way but I always play and it, it it is the creative side that was uh, sprinkled on me when I was born I, I never struggled to play music or dance it, 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 it's it's just the rhythms in there I could always beat things and make a tune you know so that's that But anyways, friends, before I didn't show these video, these videos I'm making um, are, are, are wanting to drag you along the, the whole process of how the, I did this log. Harvey saw, friends, okay, so that we've been beating up Scotty's 86er. Scotty, well done. It's, it's at a really nice spot right now. I'll find out next time I started it. Last time in the video, you guys saw me on the back of the tailgate. I wanna learn my saws and, and, and because Restarting is a big thing, especially on jobs like this. You run down to the pickup truck, you're setting up rigging and ropes and this and that. You don't want to sit have the saw idle. You want to be able to come back and pull. So I chose to fatten the low jet and increase a bit of idle so that my starting would be better. It seems to work on this saw. So Scotty saw took a beating over the last couple of days, but I brought Iron Horse's saw out. And, and I didn't get to show it yesterday. So this is Iron Horse's 86er with a square, a square ground chain. And I actually played with my grinder again, friends. I just cannot express to you folks that come here the feeling I have right now of, of getting stronger. So, some, something's let loose and, it, and, it, and it's coming and, and we're planning a big trip. It's a big job. This ain't no, this ain't no, let's go horse around. This is a job. It, it's, it's a big falling job actually. There's been a fella reach out with some equipment, some saws, people are reaching out. We'll see how that goes. Uh, a little mini excavator would be nice on, on one corner of the lots and the hydro lines and the roads. We'll see what happens there. But anyways, regardless, let's get into this. Um, there's so much to talk about. Um, Johnny McCormick. Jeremy Buchanan. These are guys that 
follow along and have been for a long time. John McCormick's my friend. Jeremy Buchanan has been a big support to this channel. He's bought in my special axes. He's always supported the side of the channel that I have trouble talking about. And, and, it, and it's, it's just, they're, they're just so supportive. I, I don't, I never came here to ask for anything from anyone ever. And I never have and never will. But these gentlemen in behind the scenes at buckandbillyray.com and I know they don't want me saying this so I won't say much. Jeremy, thank you. John McCormick, thank you. And any of the others that have been over to buckandbillyray.com and read the recipient program and helped out, thank you. That's what it's about. This Daryl character, he got his saw. I'll show you a clip of that in the video. He started it. He's running it as we speak. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I love it. But anyways, this is a long enough video. Let's get in. I want to share Iron Horse's saw with you. And this happened before I pulled the log yesterday. So I just want to keep the videos kind of sprinkling along. We got a live feed tomorrow at one o'clock and I'm looking forward to it. Love yous. Friends, I know I talk about things on the channel that are kind of cutter, cutter savvy. Like, I know it's hard for some folks to understand what I'm talking about, but nonetheless, I try to articulate it properly. Cutting with ground chain, it's something, it, you, you just can't explain it. The saw becomes smooth like butter in your hands. Uh, it's, it's just another realm of cutting but this has been a hand file job the main the main part of this job has been hand filed just because of the situation but this is glorious such a nice person 
when you're doing the things you want to do for yourself like without you you're you're no good to nobody do you know what i'm saying about that like do the things that make you feel good inside nurture your spirit nourish nourish your your spirit i don't know why this this has done it for me it, it, this was something i decided to do many many years ago i decided to live on a saw this is the decision that changed my life i'm telling you this i'm sitting here watching this and the joy I, 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 so what I'm saying is I will be so nice to you after doing this, but if I don't get to do this for long periods of time, I really, my mental and spiritual side has to pull up the straps. We're three pieces, friends. If you're out there, gentlemen, and I know it's difficult to get moving sometimes. I do, I understand. But do things that, that give you reason to feel good about yourself. Giving is one of those, but there's another piece to it and it's doing stuff that nurtures the spirit. there's about three minutes of drumming coming up at the end of this video just a little intro here this is a groove that I've been it just comes out of me this groove it, it, you know what I mean it's just one of those zooms but filling space with the snare hand the ghost notes the so it progresses through the three minutes the left hand Drummers, people who just watch, enjoy. I love you. Thank you for being here. I feel wonderful. And I'm going to be patient and know that the only thing that is constant in this world is change. We can feel great one day. Then the next day, 
We may not. You may feel great for a week, a year, a month. But things will come. And it's who you are in regards to those things which really defines you. And it finds out how strong your spirit is. And when you start taking your life out on people and show your weakness is when there's a problem. You are your problem. Not me, not the world, not the government, not your parents, you. Take responsibility. Enjoy this little drum out. I love you. Work hard, be honest, and be kind. And let the guy in front of you driving down the road.